Hello guys, I feel like I've not posted in so long, but I'm actually at fashion week. I'm kind of recovering at the minute from a stomach bug. Can you imagine? So on Valentine's Day, sorry, I'm like starting on such a weird note. On Valentine's Day, had the best day ever. And then in the evening, we was meant to be going for dinner and we was at this pottery class and I literally just suddenly felt so sick and I was like we've got to go back to the hotel we was even staying in a hotel in Manchester so we went back to the hotel and I was just violently and when I tell you violently ill for the rest of the night like poor Manny had the true test of love because it was not good like the sounds that were coming out of the bathroom <laughs> I even slept naked on the bathroom floor. So that was my Valentine's Day. Um, I wasn't going to come today because I just thought I'd need time to recover. But I've really picked myself up and I'm so glad. So we're in London for Fashion Week and we've got so many shows. We're actually here with Tony and Guy, which is incredible. We've got a couple of different shows with different brands. We're actually going to one with MAC tonight, which is such a full circle moment. But I just thought I would bring you guys along. I'm so excited for this. And this is everything thing that I've been working towards like my dream when I was younger is to go to fashion week and be at fashion events so this is just so special for me but I'm not about to get soppy because I feel like I've done that too much already I'm so emotional this week it's a joke but anyway I will show you around our hotel room this is probably one of the nicest hotel rooms I've ever stayed in it's so beautiful it's not very big but just like the little accents around the room are gorgeous. So we're actually staying at Nobu. I'm living for it. I'm in my, what is this era? What are we gonna call this era? Let me know in the comments, but I'll show you around the room. Obviously gotta give you a room tour. So as you come in, by the way, let me show you the room key. It's a little spoon. So as you walk in, this is the room. It is so cozy and I love these lights. There's a nice big bed, which obviously I've already laid on. It's literally like a cloud. Um, a little desk area. The view isn't great, but Manny actually really likes it because he was saying it's very New York. But for me, I'm gonna just keep these shut for now. Thank you. Um, and then we've got a big TV here. We've got the best stocked mini bar. Ever. Look at the little tea set. That is the cutest thing. We're definitely going to have some tea, even though we're not really tea drinkers, but I'm just going to drink it because that is so adorable. The bathroom has incredible lighting. I don't know why it's all like this, um, but this is the bathroom. And look at the sink. It's like a gold sink. And also we have hotel robes. Thank God. And these are the softest ones yet. I feel like if I'm allowed, I'm going to take one of these as well. You know what's so funny? Whenever I do get ready with me TikToks, the one question I always, without a shadow of a doubt, get asked, asked is where my robe is from. And it was literally from a hotel. And I'm like, let's concentrate on the outfit people, please. <laughs> and not the hotel robe. But I'm going to take that one if I can and watch. Everyone's going to start asking where the robe is from and not where the outfit's from. What does that say about my style? <laughs> but anyway, we have already been to a show this morning. We came down so early just for this show. And you know when you wake up and you think, is this going to be worth it? Like this show better be worth being up early for. And it was. It was incredible. I didn't take you guys because I didn't start the vlog. But I did get a couple of clips on my phone, which I'll insert. the show we went to it was the Petsa and again it was a dream brand these dresses are so stunning I'm actually off to a hair appointment now because we have another show this evening with Mac but yeah I just wanted to start the vlog I'm so excited to be here and I'm so happy that I get to bring you guys along as well you gonna sit there this was today's look this was definitely by accident I know not everyone is gonna love it I probably would have hated this as well a year ago but I kind of like it now. So this wasn't planned, but because I was so late on the train and I literally had to go from the train straight to the show, 
I didn't have time to change. So what I did was, this was basically a normal bralette. And then I changed the straps on the bralette. I still have my sweatpants on, but then I just put heels on with it. And I'll show you what it looks like at the bottom. Like it actually goes really well. And then I just stuck this hat on and suddenly it's a fashion week outfit. And to be fair, you won't believe this, but the amount of people papping this outfit and asking me to take pictures was ridiculous. So I must be doing something right. Okay, I must be doing something right. It was probably the hat. The hat, the hat is a look in itself. And I know, like I've said, not everyone's gonna love it. And that is fine. We're all allowed to like different things. I just think these heels go so well with these pants. I was actually gonna change into my trainers again, but I like the way this looks too much, so we're actually gonna spend the day in heels, which I'm gonna regret later, but we're gonna do it anyway. <laughs> like they're about to drop off oh my god we've done so much walking today i feel like i haven't really vlogged that much um but we're back now we went to another show i didn't vlog it because it was very weird like when manny comes back up he's just going to go and get our food because we've ordered shake shack um but when manny comes back up i'll get him to tell you like it was just very weird this is my hair by the way it's quite short, like she did cut quite a bit off. I know it needed to come off, so that's what I'm telling myself. I mean, it's it's shorter than I wanted to go, but it's fine. But yeah, we've got a Shake Shack coming. It's currently, oh my God, it's 20 past 11. It's, um, why is this delivery man still messaging me? What you got there? <laughs> Yum. Ooh, wee. Smell good. Ooh, brother. Oh my God, I never knew Shake Shack came like that. That's so came weird. A bit too much. Yeah. Because I thought it didn't come at all. Literally. <laughs> this is what we got. We got fries, some chicken bites. I got the chicken burger. This is the best chicken burger ever. I'm gonna do a bite and I'm gonna sign off. <laughs> Dr. Wong suggested we experiment. We've been watching pornography together. Oh, I genuinely think Shake Shack do the best burgers. Good morning, guys. It is so early. It's like 8 a.m. It's not that early, but for a Saturday when you're meant to be having a lie in, that's early. Manny's still fast asleep, but I've got this thing now where my body wakes me up at 8 o'clock every morning. And it's not even 8 o'clock, it's like usually 10 to 8 and I just can't get back to sleep. Like I went to bed at 1 o'clock last night, so it's not that, that late. Like I've still had 7 hours sleep, which is fine, but I just have this thing now where I can't lie in and it's so annoying. I've come to the gym. Um, I had no intention of coming to the gym while I was in London, even though I've brought my gym stuff. But I always bring my gym stuff just in case. And it's in case of situations like this, but I've got my gym stuff on and I'm actually kind of glad because I never make the most of the hotel gyms, like I never end up going. So I'm going to go to the gym. I'm probably just going to do half an hour because I think we're going to do a lot of walking today. So I don't want to exhaust myself, but it's just better than lying there, scrolling through your phone. My voice still hasn't woken up. I'm sorry. Um, also, this is really random. Tammy Ambrose staying here. I saw her this morning and I was like, oh my God, love you. <laughs> Not to sound like a fangirl, but I actually love her. So if she comes in the gym and tells me how she's got her bum like that, I'd be very happy. <laughs> shower this robe is the 
best robe I've ever put on my body but there was a little ticket on it that said if you take the robe you can you can take the robe but it's 75 pounds 75 pounds for a robe like is it skims is it skims just about to order me a mani a matcha i'm trying not to drink too much coffee at the minute especially after my stomach bug i feel like i've really just been put off coffee which is so unlike me this is my order from starbucks by the way if anyone wondered so it's an iced matcha with coconut milk and vanilla syrup and it is delicious so today we actually don't have any show well we do have a show but I think it's just not really our vibe so we're not gonna we're not gonna go to it but we're just gonna do a little bit of shopping i also have um i also have a delivery that i'm waiting on that i've ordered to the hotel and i've also got something that i need to pick up in selfridges oh, i mean the last time i was let loose in london we all saw what i did we all this is what i did this necklace so i'm trying not to go too crazy today but I'm with Manny and Manny is like my auntie where if I'm like, do you think I should buy this? He's never going to say no. I've been looking forward to this ice matcha since I ordered it and it's coming. It's a frap. It's actually quite nice, I but like it's it. got, do you like it? I like it a lot. It's got like this vegan whipped cream on it, which is quite nice. Try this, like sip the top. It's vegan. Oh, that's yum. I'm not mad at it, but you know when you're really looking forward to something? mind i've never had a matcha frap before though and it's actually quite nice got a little setup over here i'm gonna film a tiktok get ready with me i'm just trying to choose between these two tops to be honest this is today's outfit i have filmed a tiktok if you want to know where everything's from i need the bag in it this bag literally has me in the biggest chokehold i think it's my favorite color so that's probably why i love it so much but this is what the fit looks like i've also got my chanel's on i'm gonna have to throw a jacket on with this because i didn't really bring one to go with it so i'm just gonna put this on with it it doesn't really go but it will have to do we're in weekday and we was probably here like 10 minutes and i've already got a ray of clothes it's so nice in here um but i'm gonna try some bits on i also love this I feel like I could make a good look out of this, maybe with like a skirt. Right. I don't know whether I'm like overkilling den denim at the minute. Because it's in, isn't it? Denim's in. That's true. And when you're done with um, it, stop wearing it. Yeah, I'm going to try this on. And then I also have... Um, I'll show you all the bits that like are actually nice. The other bits are just basics. These jeans. And then I don't know how you feel about this, but I can imagine this like being a slouchy. What do you think? I like. You actually? Yeah. Maddie's a bit funny about knit stuff, but I think this could be quite. Cool. In fact, I'll try this one now. Oh, we're all here. Yeah, I think I think we're gonna take this one. Maybe I'll do like a little. It's actually been so nice because I've met so many of you today and usually in London like I meet a few of you but it's more Manchester that I meet people but I've literally bumped into so many of you today and it's been so nice. Um, it's always my favourite thing as well when you come over and say hi so please never be shy. These are the things I'm going to buy. I just lost the sunglasses. I think they've put them back. So now I have to find them again. I got these fire ones and there was only one pair left. So I'm hoping they're still there. This honestly might be one of the best ramen I've ever had. It's so good. It's like creamy broth. It's incredible. And me and Manny eat quite a lot of ramen. Went and did the little house moving castle exhibition. It was so interesting. Like, so apparently to make one frame, like one second, it takes three weeks just for one second. So to make a whole movie, I can't even imagine how long it takes, but it's actually really good. So if you're ever in London, it's literally free to go and have like a little tour around it. Um, but I think we're gonna do some shopping now. If you didn't already know, look who's stocked here now. This is in Selfridges, Jean Vintage is now stocked in Selfridges and they have the skirts 
that you guys always ask me about. I posted in a skirt like this and it was made for me. So Jean Vintage actually stocked them in Selfridges. I think they're online as well. Also, I've picked up some bits. Look how cute this skirt is. I'm obsessed with it. But for these ones, these ones look a bit weird at the back, but I've actually got a look for these for Fashion Week. I've basically ordered a coat to the hotel and I'm praying that it comes because if it does, then it's my outfit for tonight. And if not, I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. Because of the stomach bug, I really don't know what I've packed. I literally just threw the suitcase together in the morning and I was out of the door by 9 a.m. Like, it was so rushed. So, I'm really not prepared. Like, for Paris, I was so prepared. But London, not so much. So, this is why shopping is necessary. Hi guys, it's me from the future. Um, I'm editing this vlog now and realised that I've basically deleted the rest of the footage of the day. So it skips straight to the morning, which makes no sense. And this vlog is literally going to shit. But um, yeah, I went to a show in the evening. We came back, we ordered food, you know how it goes. But yeah, sorry about that. There's a lot of missing footage, but what can you do good morning guys we're up and out early this morning we've got our hotel slippers on these are so comfy by the way look at our little feet our feet are so wide bro look how wide <laughs> our feet are <laughs> they don't even go in we're gonna go for the hotel breakfast this morning and we're gonna have an early start because we can't miss any more shows i don't know whether we've mentioned but we've missed two shows while we've been here so we don't want to miss any more, especially this one. And I know this one's going to be good. I've put an outfit together in my head. I haven't properly tried it yet, but I'm really hoping it looks how I think it's going to look. I just, I was up last night and I was thinking, I really haven't brought any outfits. Like, I thought I had quite a lot, but... Yo, I can wear this out, you know. The slippers? Yeah. Are you sure? No, they make your feet look so small. You don't like it? No. I love it. I call these the Hallelujah 3000s. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Well. Also, I'm attempting something with my hair. I don't think this is gonna work personally, but we're gonna we're gonna try anyway. I'm gonna do something crazy with my makeup today as well because what I think I'm gonna wear is like green, like the skirt's green. And Mac obviously sent all that stuff over yesterday. And they sent us home with a goodie bag last night as well, which I'll show you, but there's some weird colors in there. And there's this mint green that I think could go really well on my eyes. So we'll see. But for now, I need to eat. I forgot to show breakfast, but that was absolutely delicious. Well, it is delicious. The scrambled egg. We also have an another round of like fruits and stuff, but it's not really that much option in here, I'm not gonna lie. How was yours? I had a croissant with a pan of chocolate. Manny tried some smoked fish. Yeah, no. It was really, don't pick you up with your hand. It was really smoking. I did a bit of a different makeup look and I actually really like it. I did film it for TikTok. It was using the new palette. I think I've put it away now, but Mac have basically collabed with this brand, Richard Quinn, that we went to see last night. And the palette is stunning. Like, it's all pastel -y. And when I saw it last night and I remembered I had this skirt, I was like, maybe I do a different eye look tomorrow. Because like I was saying, I've literally hardly brought any clothes. So when I saw the green, it inspired this whole look. And you know when you put a look together in your head and it looks even better when you put it on. I don't know whether you can see it properly, but I've just got this vintage Cavalli top on. A corset over the top and then this little Mistress Rocks skirt. And then I've also just pinned it with a Chanel badge and I think it looks really cute. And then I've also got these on. I know these are a love-hate. I know a lot of people commented saying they hated them, but I really like them. The Mesa Margiela's with Manny's socks over as like warmers. I wanted to take you backstage, but it was too hectic. But the show's about to start. It looks insane. Also, Georgia Smith is one of the models and she's insane in person, like gorgeous. Hello guys, I may as well have called this vlog the Hotel Diaries because 
I feel like this room is all you've seen. And this is a mental note to myself, just not to vlog Fashion Week. Like, it's too hectic. This is why I didn't vlog Paris Fashion Week, because there was just so much going on. And I don't know, like, you always just end up bumping into people. There's just a lot. So I'm not actually going to vlog Fashion Week ever again. I'm saying that. Maybe I will. I think just TikTok vlogs are just so much easier. You know what I mean? But... Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. I'm back and I'm editing the vlog, so hopefully I can get it up tonight. I feel like it's literally been so shit, I'm sorry. Um, but I'll probably do a weekly vlog next week and I'm kind of thinking I want to go back to Paris. But we'll talk about that next week. Okay, love you guys. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.